So this is the Nokia 5.1. Now the Nokia 5.1 is more than nice to sell better in 2018. For one, we have less bezel all around. We get no home button and fingerprint scanner anymore at the front, but we got the fingerprint scanner now at the back. At the back, we will also find the 16 megapixel camera. And at the front, we have a 5.5 inch 4HD plus panel. It is an IPS panel. We get the CPU of Helio P18 we get 16 gigabytes of internal memory and two gigabytes of RAM. Now the two gigabytes of RAM worries me for multitasking, but we will have to wait and see how it actually performs. Again, I would expect three gigabytes or four gigabytes for 193 euros. The memory inside we can overcome via micro SD. However, the RAM you cannot overcome. You cannot add more to it. According to GSM Arena though, there is a version with 2GB of RAM and 32GB of internal memory, but that is not for sale here in the Netherlands. Overall, I think the Nokia 5.1 looks pleasing and it looks a lot like the Nokia 8. It also has the same color options, so we get this blue one, the black one and the copper version. It looks nice and we have these rounded edges where it feels really solid and nice in the hand because of it. Around the power button and the fingerprints, uh, around the power button and the volume, and of course the camera itself, we have this chamfered edge that is made silver. Again, this looks really pleasing. At the bottom, we have a micro USB port, and at the top, we have this nice thing uh, which is called um, how is it called again? Oh, yeah, a headphone jack, which is a really nice and functioning thing to have on your phone. Yeah, let's keep that. I like that anyway. The Nokia 5.1 looks pleasing, it feels really good, but I'm worried about the 2GB of RAM and I don't know uh, the Helio P18, but I don't have a lot of good experience with the Helio CPU overall. Let's find out that of course how it really performs, but the Nokia 5.1 seems to be reaching a bit of a higher price than it should be. Either way, stay tuned for more, of course, which is the Xiaomi Mi 8 SE. And of course, the HTC U12 Plus. Now, on this one, something might be revealed. Not sure yet. Was really hard to shoot with this one, though. But either way, either way, this is the Nokia 5.1, and we will find out how it performs, how it will uh, run everything, and of course, how the two gigabytes of RAM and the Helio P18 will make this phone in general. Have a good one, and talk to you guys in the next.